let me show you a Code Canyon script that you're going to be able to upload on your VPS or shared hosting and have all the files so you can modify or keep updating it. It's called Premium URL and it's a link shortener that you don't have to pay month to month. So let's go check it out right now. Hey, what's up everyone? This is a PHP script and that means that you are going to upload it on your shared hosting or your VPS plan. Now, the idea is that you're going to receive the files so you can upload them and you are going to be owning them. That means that you're not going to pay someone else month to month for the dedicated service. The downside is that, yes, you need to make the installation or pay for someone to install it. But once it's done, it's going to be a breeze. All right. So right now, this script is $45 and it's a regular license. That means it's for your use and not for reselling. And this is going to have a six month support all right so do consider that and if you are going to need to sell this to someone else have the payment gateways and be able to sell it you're gonna have to pay the extended license which is 225 dollars okay now when i made the last video it was premium URL shortener 6 now it's in version 7 so it's updating constantly and yes you're going to be able to upload it but you won't get the support after six months do consider that all right now in this case this is what i use for my link shortening needs so basically i do recommend it so the only downside is you have to upload the files and maintain it and make sure that you have a secure hosting service. Now, before we get started, let me show you the sponsor for this video, which is Hostinger. Yes, they do have shared hosting plans and BPS that you can upload this script to there. All right. So let me show you the shared hosting plan that they have. We'll go into hosting, web hosting, and they have several affordable plans that you can grab right here. For example, let me show you the most popular one, which is $3.99 a month. Let's go ahead and choose this plan because I'm going to show you how to apply an extra discount coupon code. That's going to reduce the price even more. Now, once you're here, Hostinger is going to ask you how many months do you want to pay in advance? I recommend 48 months because you lock in the lowest price, lowest renewal price, and you're good to go for 48 months. Now, down here, you're going to have an option that says have coupon code. So enter here, SAS master and apply it. And the price is going to drop even more. So here we go. Right now, it's $191 with 52 cents. And now it's $172 with 37 cents. So if you plan to grab a share hosting plan, use my coupon code. All right. So Premium URL shortener. This is my site where I have my shortening link needs. And this is my sasmaster.link domain. That's where I uploaded it. So this is on a BPS that I'm using a hostinger. And this is where I shorten my links. OK, so first of all, you're going to have a complete landing page right off from the installation. You're going to have links here. You have a blog. You got deals to link somewhere else. If you add those links, you got resources, help center. It even has API. You can have a user interface where you can log in and register. In this case, since it's only my site, you can log in, but you won't be able to register. And this is the back end. OK, so there's two back ends when you jump into premium URL shortener. One is the back end where you're actually shortening links and doing bio pages, QR codes, statistics and all that stuff. And then you have your admin section. Um, let's get started with the front end so you understand the features that it has. And then we'll jump into the admin section. OK. So first off, you're going to be greeted with this landing page from the dashboard. You're going to have your overall links. This, these are the links that I've created previously, the clicks that they've had and the recent clicks. All right. To shorten a link is super easy. I just grab any link right here. For example, my domain. Sassmaster.net and I have options available here. I can just go ahead and straight shorten it right here or I can add more options here. If I shorten it, it's going to add a random end to that link. So it's going to be forward slash. Um, some random text and that's going to be my link. But no, I want to have a custom link that I can remember and have my viewers remember the link also. So that means that this is the domain I'm going to select. If you have several domains connected, you can go ahead and select it from here. OK, custom domain, for example, I'll say SAS master test and delete because I want to delete it. All right. And if it's going to be a redirect, no, if I want to have a frame or, or frame or flat splash, I can enable it here. As assign a link to a channel in this case. No, but I can password protect description. I also have more options to customize. There's so many options here. You can meta tag this. You can geo target this. So that means that if you want to send someone else to a different section of your website because they're in a Latin American or Spanish speaking country, send them to a different link that is possible using this deep linking. So they jump into the device. For example, if it's a Facebook link, it's going to take them to Facebook, the app on the mobile phone, device targeting, language targeting, pixels to retarget pixels, expiration, A-B testing and parameters. All those options available and the description to find this later on. So once you're good to go, go ahead and shorten this and boom, we have a link right here. See how it's on my domain. 
and this is the what i've added for random as my link shortener uh, destination okay obviously you're going to add something that's really easy to discover for example i don't know sas or sas master and your users can find this really easy you have the download for the qr code you can download a png pdf and svg go ahead and copy this and you have a link shortener once that's done you're going to find it here in case you need it later on now with this you're going to have a lot of analytics okay so that means that if you are going to view what's going on with the link you'll have for example here's 25 clicks for this particular link and i'm going to be able to view the analytics for this one for example here's the clicks top countries the the summary country by cities here we go here's the cities platforms i'm able to view if it's windows Android, I, iphone etc it, it helps me take decisions later on browsers for example which one is the most popular one in this case chrome languages english unknown russian portuguese etc refers so these are coming from youtube from email direct and facebook and there's no a b testing testing on this link so there's nothing there so that is how easy it is to shorten a link and you have all your recent links here recent activity from for example 18 minutes ago this link was clicked on and then we have the option to create bio pages so all that is bundled in this okay so all that's included so now i'm able to create pages for example this right here has 3861 views i created this one two years ago and if i go ahead and open this up right here here it is more deals chrome extension and it's just something that i created obviously this is not in mobile view but if you're into mobile you're going to view it like this okay so it's a pretty cool way to create bio links here with this one and you could create as many as you want and shorten as many links as you want and receive as many clicks as you want because these files are hosted on your hosting service okay now you can also create qr codes which um i haven't created any because i don't have the need for these but you have several options for this you got your qr code go ahead and add all the information you need here and you have a qr here QR code that you can download, all right? So it's a really great option, especially if you're creating menus with a link, something like that, for example, a menu for a restaurant, you can create a QR code. And the good thing about this is that if the main domain changes for the menu, just update it here. You don't need to create a new QR code, all right? Then you have your statistics, which you saw already. You got my channels, which you can create right here. You got all the list of links that you've created, your archived links in case you deleted them expired links if you run campaigns you got custom splash call to action overlays tracking pixels uh, call to action overlays work when you certain pages block these but you can create an overlay inside of them okay uh, branded domains you can add them here you got your team members that so you can work on this particular dashboard integrations and tools for example integrations these are the ones available and you have several tools available here for importing links developer api and this is included with all that, all right? Now, like I said, this is the front end. This is how you're gonna be able to use it. Whoever you give access to is gonna be able to use it this way. And the back end is over here on the admin section. On the admin section, let's go ahead and jump here. It changes a bit. You don't create links here and you get a bunch of options here to customize your link shortener script, okay? So that means you can view links from everyone. You can view the user here. So if you need to create a user, you can do so here manually. You can add users, you can ban users, you can create team members, import users, testimonials, etc. all from here. That means that, for example, if you are on the regular license, yes, you can create users so they can have their own dashboard and create their own links. But basically, you're not reselling this. So no, no problems with that, okay? Remember, on the extended license, you do get the payment access option. In this case, you don't, all right? So I'm on the regular license because this is only for my use. It's not for reselling, all right? You, you can create membership. You can create plans. You can't create payments because you're not. I'm not in the extended plan in this case. Bio pages. You have. You can view all the bio pages here. You can view all the users' bio pages, all the users' links, etc. You can modify them. You can delete them. You can view what's going on. Maybe they're spamming. Maybe they're sending out um, scamming people. And you can track all that with this. Okay. You can also have a block right here. You can add posts to the blog. I've added some before. Um, the options are kind of basic in this sense, but you got the main options, for example, titles, log, category, etc. And you can upload it here, right? All posts, categories, you got pages, you can create pages here. So right now, all my pages, um, well, I don't have any, but if you add pages, you would have them right here, okay? You got your domains that you can connect here. So you can add domains as many as you want. Remember, you are not limited in your script, okay? Verifications, in case you want to verify users, which I don't find useful unless you are selling this to someone the help center that you can create here create articles how to create links how to create a how to connect the domain etc you can do it to, from here 
affiliate system advertisement themes in this case not many themes available but you have two options here or create a child theme and obviously modify it all right you got your custom css obviously you can do whatever you want with the css you got the editor to edit the page you got your language and emails you got your plugins you got add-ons that you can add here for example from here upload a plugin go to marketplace if you want here we go there's plugins that you can install some of them i don't need that's why i don't have them but they're available here some are free and some are paid all right so for example razor pay the payment system you need to purchase that in case you want to implement that on your site all right you got your overall settings general settings here like the link the description etc all right here and you got all the options available here from security from theme from qr etc all are there right and tools and newsletters from here statistics cron job and update this is one of my favorite features on premium url shortener that means that if i want to update my script which i'm in this right here i need to back it up before i actually update it but I'm on 7.4.2 right now. It's 7.4.4 and I just click update and it's going to update. All right. So I don't need to re-upload scripts. I don't need to replace files like I would with some of the other scripts. In this case, it's super easy to update. So as I mentioned in the beginning, um, just go ahead and install it, which would be the hardest part about this, but it's not hard, but that would be the hardest part, right? Or you can pay someone to install it for you. And once that's done, you can go ahead and update it from here. You won't need that person anymore once it's done. So it's a super great way to shorten links with a script that you own, you upload the files. And I do have to give you a warning here. Remember, these are files that you are going to install. These are files that you are going to be in charge of. So that means that if you don't have a virus protection, if you don't have a firewall, if you need to make some modifications, if something breaks, you have to take care of all of that. OK, they don't do that. They only help you with support which means if something is not working on the script that should work, they'll help you with that. But if, if it's an installation thing, if it's, it's something else that you have, you got hacked or something like that, it's not the responsibility. So you have to consider that when you are not paying a subscription, someone when you pay a subscription, well, obviously someone is going to help you and they take, take care of everything. They take care of backups, helping and that everything is working great. In this case, no, you are going to take care of all of that, right? So do consider that it's a give or take depending on what you want if you don't have issues you want to, don't want to deal with any of this then i do recommend that you jump into a subscription or something else that's on a lifetime deal but they host it not you all right and if you want to grab a shared hosting plan don't forget to use my coupon code all right and that's a wrap for premium url shortener